Check this all out. Right no, dude. <laughs> Nobody look at him in the eyes. Just Some, you're dying. I don't care about looking at me. I don't want to scare any neighbors. I want to. Yeah, I, like, I like the face too. Yeah. We're not gonna see you. Like the <laughs> Do you see these guys? <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. So at that point, when we hear this word "ass scream," that's Greg getting his guts ripped out by a raptor because we're inside right now. We're talking all of a sudden. Like, what, what the fuck? So that we don't we don't have this fake being sucked into the bushes thing because raptors don't do that. They would actually jump on top of you and beat the living shit out of you and rip your head off and stuff. Oh, you have experience with raptors? Yes. So what's going to happen is at that point, somebody's going to yell, "Hey, contact front door!" And that's when everybody needs to spring into motion. So however we have set up, there's windows in here. There's a window in this room, there's a window in this room, there's a window here. Um, obviously, some of us are going to go into more of a defensive position. So at that point, you're going to take Doc, yeah. you're going to fucking hunker him down, PSD type stuff. Yeah. At that point, you guys are probably going to chill back and kind of hang. And then all of you guys, the gun, gun guys, Bailing. are boom, pop into a window. And that's when Bruce is running out with Rono. Mm -hmm. Okay, two guys come out here. And at that point, that's when... That's when Rono comes out, boom, boom, boom. Bruce comes over the top of him. He's all fucking ripped apart. And then that's when the 46 just starts ripping off. <laughs> and then you're just going at it. You're going to catch the links, You guys so. are, I don't know if we're going to, we're probably going to do a 203 at that point. It's dark. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I would personally, but I'm, I want this as loud as craziness. So those two guys are, are, are running it out. And at that point, uh, we haven't discussed because we haven't gotten the script yet. We're going to do that later tonight, so I didn't want to get that far along. I just wanted to see who, at, the, at this point, be ready to spring into action and go into a, a door and a window. So everybody's kind of running through the building CQB, so we might get some individual shots of guys just kind of boom, 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 so you see this flow. And it's all one open room. There's no walls or structures inside that room that so that's separated what they, out. That's what they drew out, but you know the layout yeah. better. So there's so. no walls inside. Right? This is actually pretty accurate. This is the... Which building is this? Okay, yeah. This is the building we were in the other day. Because you know, there's a warehouse. But inside this room? Oh, oh no, no, no. no. It's, it's the room we're in? Was there anything? Tires, is it just big, the airsoft? It's a big, place airsoft. Right. Okay. It's a big tire field right yeah, here. Yeah, but inside this, is there? Is it just four walls and we're just in an open space? No, I'm trying to remember. Or are there fake walls exactly in there and stuff? Or CQB stuff? Is okay, got it. So, yeah, the warehouse is here. We're going to go into um, setting up the scene. We're inside talking. Everybody's resting. Scream. Somebody says contact door, Flint contact front. runs out. Yeah, he'll probably yell, contact front door. So would we That's be when he runs out. That's when Bruce comes out, rocks the guns, and then we're going to go through the script on what else is happening inside with the dialogue also. But that's just the actions of everybody springing up and moving from a training standpoint for us to get in our mind of imagine yourself. You don't have to, we don't have to do it, but if you want to sit down and practice grabbing a gun and getting up real quick and then poke it into a door, like, come over here and stand and watching, that's where the leans are going to start to come to play, looking out the windows. So if the camera's coming by you, you're actually being active, not just standing there like this. Okay? So you're active in the window. That's what we're trying to get down right now. My, my question is, though, he's going to grab him, go into a corner, full defensive deal. We're not engaging at all. We're just at a low ready, like sort of second tier from him in a yeah. corner, basically. So we're looking for work. Because what we are... Like, <laughs> anybody, any windows open? Yeah, what we are is a headquarters element of this team. So we will just hang back. <laughs> That's what we got gun guys for. These guys are shooters. All right, right. So shooter, 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 shooter. These are the dudes that are going to be freaking rocking the guns. So we'll just hang back. We're command and control. Yeah, so your engine, I, if you and I die, you just got no, a bunch no, of gun Copy that, engine. copy so that. So that's so. why we need to take that presence right. and hold back. And obviously, we don't want her being the expert yet eaten up. No, no, no so. doubt, no doubt. But I just wondered how aggressive you want our stance inside the house. Are we even halfway energetically engaging, or are we just sort of like low ready back in the corner, or just? It's like a little ready back in the corner. Okay, yeah, all right. Yeah, there's no aggression needed on that, because I'm if I'm in the middle of the room, I'm actually just walking around making sure everybody's kind of tracking on what's going on. Right. I'm not like this in the room, because what am I, I'm yeah, not yeah, shooting anything. Okay. He's, so, he's basically making sure everybody else went to the yeah. points of So you're doing that, should you are gonna be doing that. I don't need, no, because my team, if I say, hey, split, they run right now. If I told these guys to go check a corner, check a door, check the, the front gate, they would go to it immediately. I would right. have to say, hey, you go to that door. No, no, no. Hey, you go to that door. Okay, okay you, uh, let me find a window for you. Hold on, I'll be back in a second. But you're not oh, going to be at a window. You're not going to be at a window. And then at that point, I'm probably going to be coming up to you uh, just kind of hanging in there. Okay. And then Thanks, at baby. that point, um, 
I mean, even Doc, I mean, what's going on? What's going on? Like, it's a fucking dinosaur, Doc, obviously. You know, shut up. <laughs> shut the fuck up. But what uh, type? <laughs> <laughs> I think we'll get into all that stuff once we get there. Yeah, you I think I'm going to go that yeah. far. Yeah. With the small amount of people, with the small amount of people that we have, you essentially look to what everyone else is covering and see what your, your gun is not pointing the same direction as somebody else's unless there is like... Copy that. No, I'm, we're, I'm talking more of a character thing. Okay, gotcha. If he wants us to just stay low right in the back or... Even I no, 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 just even slightly active. He goes outside, he gets even. And at that point, if we have, let's let's say the room looks like this. So now, if I was to set you in your positions in the room, imagine yourself sitting in a room that's about as big as this back porch here. That's about all it is, right? So, Rono and um, Sean can be bullshit sitting down, just talking. Bruce is just kind of walking around. Do you have your weapon on or not? I would, point? yeah. You would have it on. Okay, maybe he's chilling. Yeah, he's putting uh, just sitting down. Out. So at that point, we would have... Maybe there's going to be some type of dialogue that we haven't talked about yet between you two with this data and then you coming up and interrupting. I think that's when this happens. So. Yeah, sure. It, it happens on the heels of this. I mean, the last version I read, it was actually you guys sort of ignore me. And then I'm like, oh, well, we should set up for the night. So that's the last one I read. But so if we're actually doing on the heels, I agree. I think that should just happen as a quicker pace anyway. Go ahead. So, and I'm distracted because why would we set up some kind of situation where somebody could get eaten? We're not. We're not no, we're just posted up for the night for safety. Well, why, why does he die? I told he goes out to the check the security system. system. So we're in the building. We have security outside. The system goes down. He goes out to see why it went down. And gets eaten because the raptors are smart. The raptors are smart. Remember that line? That's why we, <laughs> the rest of us, stay inside the building. We don't just rush out. Next morning, still. Two raptors yeah. playing so chess. We're not, we're not going to be patrolling through the woods at night. A raptor yeah. right. right. We're right. finding a hard point which he knew about. So he's taking us all there. He took us to a safe. Point. So it's a safe point. Okay. okay. Supposedly. Sorry, Supposedly. Yeah, it didn't yeah. really work out. So at that point, we're gonna if like if we took over a house and I rock rough at this and we're gonna harden it up. We're gonna if we have any type of claymore systems or we we can set up sentries. We're gonna have positions out. So this is. A modern, we have laser systems and all this crazy shit. Uh, we're setting those up, and everybody else can kind of take a chill inside and wait for the night right. until we need to get up and start moving and be more defensive and more tactical in our patrol, which we're going to practice that the next day. Um, for this, we're all kind of relaxed inside, but you guys are having some type of dialogue in the back. Right. And at that point, so there's, I think as soon as you guys uh, are like in the end of that dialogue, the second room, no, this, apparently there's an open room, right? So, the grasslands over there, there's an open door there, you got a medium sized room, and then you have a larger room. So, so you have an entry room, and then about 20 by 10? Yeah, 20 by 10. Yeah. And there's no back wall to the room, it goes into a bigger room. This is front Why are we not just always in the door? It's a hallway that goes in that you go into very little bit. That's a whole point of the door. There's a good distance by the way. 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 There's a good distance by the that's yeah, pretty much it. You just have this so this, this room here. <laughs> so it's bigger okay, so there. Yeah. There's no there's no walls here. Then. Green so there's like a doorway. Yeah, there, there's no walls there. Yeah. So there's just a door here then. Yeah, there's just a door right there. Okay. A couple so windows. Door like like yeah. probably yeah. like that, right? Yeah. So boom. You go into this room. <laughs> okay. So who would be in this front room? You, because you're gonna run yeah. outside. You yeah. start. So you're out here, and then Flint's also in here. Yep. Because he's wanting to react first. Okay. So here we go. Greg and Flint are on the Greg, you're right there. Flint, up. Flint. Okay. Hey, Flint. Hey, uh, you're Flint. Sorry, apparently. Yeah. What are practice starts blocking out this back? Okay, sorry. You're up here. So in this room, yeah. it looks like this. You come through this door. Yeah, yeah. And then there's a room in here. Yeah. And then it opens up to the big room. So you so want me to you, hit, hit a, I think hit a doorway right here? you should be up here okay. with him, and then he's the one who goes outside. Okay. Okay. And here's, 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 a real quick, here's a real quick question. When we're pying off these corners, right? Is it better to be see, to see or to be concealed from these raptors? Because we're not fighting humans, we're fighting animals. You're pie, you're not pieing in this case. You're I know, but you know what I'm you're talking about. Outside to help a guy. Okay, gotcha. Get torn apart. Gotcha. So hopefully you can kill whatever. Well, I'm saying I'm saying in, in generalities. That's what I was, I was thinking about. That we're not ducking. Um, right. Is that your point? Yeah. No. But yeah. With the you're idea not of cover from bullets. Exactly. But yeah. we're not we're not even really. 
it's like the idea of concealment versus cover. There's a, and again, we're fighting animals. It's like, do we want to have eyes on animals first, or do we want to not be seen by them? Does that make sense? Or, or are we figured out? I would not want to be seen by a rep. I also think you but can. I, I think it's going to depend when we get there. Okay, we're yeah. scanning. And when we can see. Is that, that, a, is that this, a legitimate? Is that a legitimate this, concern or if not? If this room is big enough for you and you hear him go outside and scream, would you come up here to the door and be like this? No, I wouldn't. Like, I'd freaking yeah. No, I. And you're like contact right. Yeah, no. You're actually seeing an animal, so That's you're right. going to come out and start engaging, giving Bruce enough room to come blowing through with you to get the belt gun That's on right. target. No, okay? I got you. So that's where I don't. I think it's going to start with maybe a quick pie and then boom. But you're not going to waste time. If somebody needs support, I'm not going to pie through a house. No, I'm blowing through it. Yeah. It's called interior movement under duress. Yeah. Okay. Um, context too. Yeah. Cool. That's a good question because there might be a time to do that. That's what I'm saying. When you're, t- but, you're talking about earlier, when you're talking about movement around corners and you're like, yeah, this is where your movement comes into play. And I was thinking like, that's one of the questions. That's so, like in the, that's going to probably be more through the human fight once we started getting into that. Well, I know. That's what I'm saying. Like, we're we're operators that are fighting now against raptors instead of humans. Are we going to? Is our goal to have visual contact on animals, meaning that we have to have more eyes out there, or are we trying to reduce eyes on us? What, like as a, like this? Have you seen the animals versus? Well, I don't know if I've seen the animals. You know what I mean? It depends I, on I would still try, right. but, but now when it's hot, I'm going in. I'm going, going in. Yeah, you're going, going out, go. and you're going to expose yourself because you have to to support me. That's right. That could still be a lot. So I, I think we're. Okay. Doorways, no pine. Windows, if you're standing in a window, yeah, that's you're searching. Gotcha. Okay, cool. So here's what I would like to do. I'd like to set everybody up in the room. Kind of overthink this a little bit. In the room, so that whether you're chilling, you're sitting down, whatever. So we know Flint and him and him are up front. Bruce, you're back in yep. here. So, uh... Okay. Yeah, there's no back corner to this room, though. Is that correct? They just open right. to a bigger room. Like, this is there's this room up here. There's a wall and a wall. This is the front door. So that's why they're up in the front room because I see. So because we're in this main hear, room. He's going to hear and go out and check, and then he gets freaking eaten up. And that's when Flint comes out, and engages. Bruce comes out, and engages, and then everybody else is working. So we're in this main room. According to Greg, though, there's no back wall, so we're not really pushed up against anything. We're just sort of back far enough away to create some depth. There's no back wall in the room. I asked like a couple times. I just didn't get a clear answer. It sounds like it's a room that goes into a bigger room. It's kind of like a wardrobe that you want me to. Go all the way around. I'm gonna sh- we're gonna walk through it really slowly. Okay. So here's the deal. Let's get information right now. Mm. And just walk it through. We're being yep. deliberate. We're not being dynamic. Yes. Yeah, so just move slow. Okay. Right. Moving. Coming out. Coming moving. out. We're making that left. You're curving. You're beeline to the door. Right. So you're not fast. Stay, stay smooth, slow. Right. You guys both make entry at the same time, nope. not even stopping. So you go through, you guys come up and hold on the doors. Right Who? there. Who? You hold on the do? doors. Okay. No, you keep coming, you keep backing up. Okay. And then you say, Last man. And then you run through the door with me, Byron. No, the door's right here, guys. Got it. Got it. Got it. Thank you. Come on. So we're here. The door's right here, you run through, and then when you say last man, that's when you guys okay. go, hey, boo. And then you guys fill fill in, and then you would just hold on these points right here. Now be a hold So when you guys are right here. Okay. Hey, come up here. Right. right here. So when everybody else is funneling through with you guys, at that point we say, all right, Mike, go. Break in. And then I just hold here on this corner. He hold on that corner. Okay. So it's just a quick CQB motion. So it'd be just like this again. So he's just going to cross and stay inside the corner. Go, Mike. Boom. Now we got crossfire and everybody else is protected inside. Okay. Okay, so let's try that again from over there. Yeah, so Byron, you never stop. You just come in and say, last man, boom, boom. Like, uh, I think it's right. I think yeah, let's do that. It's a formation. It's good. This is good. We have the barriers, yeah. right? Set up in the room. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is that back bay door, right? Okay. So we're inside this building right now. Though. Okay. No, no, no. We're going. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. We're relaxed in here. Then we're going to move out to that next. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Bay door. I see. There okay, so you guys are in that corner there. Okay. There are some obstacles in the backyard, but we'll figure out how to negotiate this when we get there. So don't worry about that right okay, now. Okay, well, we let a touch or maybe we can get there or no? Right, we'll figure it out. Okay. I'm sure right. we can. All right. The question is... You're here with me. Uh, uh, oh, God. I know it's... Are you going to die again? So you're over here with me. Yep. Yeah. Blah, 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 so you guys maybe, uh, oh. just for you guys shit's sake, back it's right more like near that bag. Thanks, guys. Yep. Let's go out. Everybody uh, listen up. Not yet, not yet. Just listen. We don't need to be in dialogue. Just listen yeah. so we can pop and just yeah. walk okay. through this. Yeah, yeah. Lights go out after the conversation. Nods go down. 
He goes to check out the system. He dies. Link goes. I go from where I'm at. Coming over top. Windows, windows. Hey, generator's fucked. We need to move. Hey, listen up. Where are we going? Where, where are we got? Hey, we got a building right over there. We got generator. How far? Docking work on it. It's 20 meters. We can make it. Back entrance. Left or right or straight? It's going to go straight and about 20 meters to our left from okay, here. Okay, guys, and we're moving. You hear that? 20 move. meters left. Break it in. Go. Point. Hold on that pack strap. Don't let go. Where's this on you? Yeah, move. Moving. All right, you see the door? Yes, see it. All right, take it. Last man. And then depending on how they want to run the scene, everybody else should be fine. How about a rescue op? Two-man team, about a week ago. They missed their last chicken. Your boys are uh, rock stars. Man. Your team's good. But they've never seen a dinosaur up close, let alone a 40-foot predator face-to-face. -face. I still think it's a lot of trouble for somebody that I don't think is going to fit on the team, man. I get it. She's lived this. you got to trust me. We need her. Oh! Oh, my God.